Hi, welcome to Sizzling Pots. I'm your host Jo Suwant with yet another episode. Today I'm going to show you how to make tandoori crabs. When I went to India for my vacations last year, I ate these awesome tandoori crabs at a restaurant. I was so inspired that I came back home and tried it a couple of times. Each time that I tried it, it came out really good. So I thought I must share it with you. So here we go, tandoori crabs. To make tandoori crabs, we need two pounds of snow crabs, three fourth cup of yogurt, two tablespoons of ginger garlic paste, one tablespoon of chili paste, two tablespoons of cumin powder, one tablespoon of coriander powder, one tablespoon of red chili powder, one teaspoon of turmeric powder, two tablespoons of lemon juice, salt to taste, and finally, one tablespoon of oil. So to make the tandoori crabs, first of all, what we're gonna do is take a mallet, and what I'm going to do is crush the legs a little bit, just like this. So when we do this, what will happen is when we make the marinade, it kind of will seep inside and the meat inside will also get all the spices. To make the marinade, first we need to put the chili powder, coriander powder, cumin powder, turmeric powder, salt, red chili paste, ginger garlic paste, lemon juice, oil and finally yogurt. And now go ahead and mix everything. So once we have mixed everything, it looks like a smooth paste and uh, we're going to go ahead and apply this marinade to the crabs and we want to take one crab at a time and make sure we put all the marinade properly so that everywhere it gets the marinade on it. So friends, we have marinated our crabs now and if you have the time, you can refrigerate it for about an hour. But if you don't have the time, you can skip that. And what I've done is put it on a bakeware. I foiled the bakeware and put the marinated crabs on the bakeware. And we are going to bake it at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for about 10 minutes covered. And then for five minutes, five to 10 minutes, uncovered so the crabs have been in the, in the oven for about 10 minutes now and I'm going to uncover them and we are going to put this back in the oven for about 10 minutes so that it kind of gets dried up and it kind of gets a nice burnt texture on the top so the tandoori crabs are completely ready now and they look absolutely delicious I've also created a little bit of sauce on the side and all it is is just a little bit of melted butter and lime juice in it. If you like my recipe and you want to take it down, go to my website www.sizzlingpots.com. For this recipe and much more, this is Joe Simon signing off for today. Thank you so much for watching me. Don't forget to leave your comments.